from a station working for you. This is a WRTV update. And I'm Lauren Casey. These are your latest headlines. We could be just days away from hundreds of new faces arriving here in central Indiana. We first told you yesterday that Camp Atterbury would be housing some of the Afghans who were evacuated from their country by U.S. forces after the Taliban took over Afghanistan. Today we're learning more from the governor and the commander of the Indiana National Guard about the role the post will play in housing these evacuees. The Afghans will undergo a vetting process both overseas and here in the U.S. before they're brought to Indiana. This will include testing each of them for COVID-19. The National Guard says it's preparing for the first group of 1,000 evacuees to be here as early as the end of this week. A major new art installation is complete downtown. Check it out today. Organizers unveiled the new 3D Keepers of the Culture Mural on the north side of the Stutz building. It features the images of several of Indy's cultural leaders. They include broadcast pioneer Amos Brown, as well as entertainers Vivica A. Fox and Mike Epps. The mural is unveiling is also helping to kick off a new fine art fair. It's called Butter. It starts this weekend and it will feature works by top black artists from all across the country. Let's get a check right now of our forecast on this Wednesday with our own Alyssa Donovan. And it is a gorgeous day. If you haven't walked outside just yet, you definitely should. This is a day you want to spend outdoors. Temperatures still climbing. We're in the mid 70s right now, only going to reach the upper 70s today, so a little bit below average for our start to September and mostly sunny today. We have a few clouds still filtering through, but we're going to see plenty of sunshine peeking through as well. Gusty winds, those wind gusts out of the northeast East, about 15 to 25 miles per hour at times sustained winds about 10 miles per hour. So you're going to notice a little breeze outside too. It's going to feel nice though. Looking ahead to the rest of the week Thursday still in the 70s with pleasant conditions and then just a spot storm possible on Saturday. Melissa, thank you for our full shelf of content. Find WRTV on your Roku or Amazon Fire Stick TV. Thanks for joining us.